Virgo, this will happen in the next 48 hours for July the 21st through July the 22nd, 2024. Universal Energies, show me what I need to see for the star sign of Virgo for July the 21st through July the 22nd, 2024. Universal Energies, show me what I need to see for the star sign of Virgo for July the 21st through July the 22nd, 2024. <clears throat> Universal Energies, show me what I need to see for the star sign of Virgo for July the 21st through July the 22nd, 2024. Show me. You guys, subscribe, like, comment, and share these videos. If this does not resonate with you, check your moon, rising, and Venus sign videos. I do not read reversals. Virgo, you need to repent and get your life together. If you're interested in a private reading, you can reach me at herimmortalmajesty at gmail.com. Virgo, these are your cards, honey. <clears throat> so, Virgo, you have the hangman. Could be dealing with a Pisces, but the hangman signifies that the relationship is stagnant right now. It's suspended in the air. There's no movement, but you may be beginning to change your perspective. So listen, Virgo could be dealing with a Pisces, but you're telling me that you guys are stagnant. Something is hanging in the balance. However, you could be changing your perspective. Clarify the hangman for Virgo. Clarify the hangman for Virgo. Clarify the hangman for Virgo. It is clarified with the Empress. Could be dealing with a Libra or a Taurus, but the Empress signifies beauty, fertility, creativity, nurturing energy, love, abundance, growth, and development. This is a pregnant woman. She is symbolic of the Mother Earth. She takes the seed of something and nurtures it so that it grows abundantly. Could be dealing with a Libra or a Taurus. Could be dealing with a spouse because the Empress is a married, stable, committed person. Could be dealing with the parent of your child or someone who's expecting. Now, this can be about your abundance, but it could also be about nurturing the relationship. Clarify the Empress for Virgo. Clarify the Empress for Virgo. Clarify the Empress for Virgo. It is clarified with the Seven of Swords. Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. This is someone lying, cheating, stealing, being manipulative, trying to get away with something, someone being deceptive, someone strategically devising a plan of action, someone being sneaky, trying to escape, trying to get away with something. So listen, Virgo, some type of lying, cheating, deceptiveness here, sneakiness or sneaking off. Listen, you can tell me that you're stagnant with this Libra, this Taurus, this spouse, this parent of your child because of some type of deception. You can tell me that something is on hold because there's a deception concerning your abundance. Hmm. Virgo, you have the three of swords. Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. This is heartbreak. This is pain. This is suffering. This is agony caused by a third party situation. So when I say third party, yes, a romantic third party. But this could also be meddling family members, friends, co-workers, neighbors, Anyone being involved in you guys' relationship that shouldn't be, that is causing you heartbreak. So listen, Virgo, you're telling me that you're hurt. Now, you could be hurt because your feelings are hurt or you're hurt because there's a third party. Clarify the three of swords for Virgo. Clarify the three of swords for Virgo. Clarify the three of swords for Virgo. It is clarified with the five of pentacles, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. This is you feeling neglected, abandoned, excluded, left out in the cold. This can speak to financial lack and poverty consciousness. This could be a breakup. So Virgo, you can tell me that something is going on financially, some type of financial lack, or this is a breakup. 
Now, Virgo, you can tell me that your feelings are hurt because there's something going on with the coins here. Someone playing around with your money. Virgo, you could also tell me that you're hurt because you guys broke up over this deception. Maybe you had to break up with them because they had someone else here, a third party. And that's the deception here. Virgo, you have the Nine of Pentacles. Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. This is you saying with, without, or in spite of anyone. I alone, in my own right, am abundant, self-sufficient, independent, and single. I'm single. So Virgo, you can tell me that you're independently abundant on your own or you're single. Clarify the Nine of Pentacles for Virgo. Clarify the Nine of Pentacles. For Virgo, clarify the nine of pentacles. For Virgo, it is clarified with the ace of cups. Scorpio, Cancer, or Pisces. This is a brand new beginning in love. A brand new beginning in a deep emotional connection. This is love overflowing. A brand new blessing. A brand new beginning in love. So Virgo, new love, new start to love, or a blessing here. Now Virgo, hmm. You can tell me that you're single over some type of blessing, money, assets, resources, property, because you're hurt and there's been some type of deception. Virgo, you can tell me that you're single because they had new love, a third party, and that's the deception. Virgo, you can tell me now that you consider yourself single, you may have new love coming in. Virgo, you have the star. Could be dealing with an Aquarius, but the star symbolizes having hope, having faith, healing, getting your wish, being divinely guided, following your destiny. So Virgo could be dealing with an Aquarius, but you can tell me that you're getting your wish, following your destiny. You can tell me that you need to heal individually on your own, or you're holding out hope and faith that you guys can heal things, mend things, work things out, and reconcile. Clarify the star for Virgo. Clarify the star. Clarify the star for Virgo. Clarify the star for Virgo. Clarify the star for Virgo. It is <laughs> Okay, judgment. Now, judgment could be you passing your own final verdict and judgment over you guys as a relationship. Judgment could be the final verdict and judgment in a legal court case. But judgment is forgiveness and resurrection of the relationship. Second chances. So, Virgo, you could be passing your own final verdict and judgment here. Someone could be asking for forgiveness and a second chance. Or you're dealing with something in legal. Clarify judgment for Virgo. Clarify judgment. For Virgo, clarify judgment. For Virgo, it is clarified with the Six of Swords. Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. This is moving away to calmer waters, moving away to a place of peace. So either mentally or physically, you're wanting to move away. And this can speak to if you guys had any type of disagreements or arguments between you. Agreeing to disagree, letting bygones be bygones, and moving away to a place of peace and harmony together. Or this is you saying you just want to move out, move on, and move away from the relationship. So listen, Virgo, you can tell me that you're physically moving or traveling. You can tell me, hey, let's just put it behind us and move away to a place of peace and harmony together, letting bygones be bygones. Or you're just saying you want to move out, move on, and move away from the relationship. Now, Virgo, listen, you can tell me that you're passing your own final verdict and judgment here, deciding to move out, move on, and move away from the relationship and just heal. Virgo, you can tell me that they're asking for forgiveness and a second chance here. You may decide to heal things with this person and just put it behind you and move away to a place of peace and harmony together, letting bygones be bygones. Because now that you render yourself single, they could be coming back in wanting you back, Virgo. Mm -hmm. You'll see. You have the Ace of Pentacles, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. This is a brand new, <clears throat> excuse me, brand new opportunity of something more solid, stable, and secure coming into you. <clears throat> and this can be an offer for an invite out for dinner and a movie. This can be about making things more committed. This can be about a lump sum of money, a job offer, a raise, a promotion, a bonus. 
a high ticket item purchase, a new home, a new car, a token of love, a gift, anything of value, brand new practical beginnings. So Virgo, some type of opportunity of practicality, money, assets, resources, property, accepting a gift, giving a gift, going out on a date or a commitment here. Clarify the Ace of Pentacles for Virgo. Clarify the Ace of Pentacles for Virgo. Clarify the Ace of Pentacles for Virgo. It is clarified with temperance. Could be dealing with a Sagittarius. But the universe is cautioning you to be patient, to heal, and to remain balanced. That any decision that you make, it needs to be a careful blending of the head and the heart. Now, when we're dealing with temperance, temperance is about healing, harmony, being willing to compromise, but also reconciliation. Could be dealing with a Sag, but you can tell me that, hey, I just need to heal individually on my own. You can tell me that you're holding out hope and faith that you guys can heal things, mend things, work things out, and reconcile. Very well could be some type of compromise or negotiations going on here. Also a need for you to be patient. Clarified temperance for Virgo. Clarified temperance for Virgo. Clarified temperance. For Virgo, it is clarified with the Nine of Pentacles again. So Virgo, like I said, you can tell me that you're independently abundant on your own or you're single. Virgo, you can tell me your version of healing. <laughs> now that you're single, is to go out and mingle because you could have an offer coming in from someone. But Virgo, you could also tell me that now that you consider yourself single, this person is, like I said, wanting forgiveness, wanting to heal things here. And maybe offering you this opportunity, this cup. Virgo, you could also tell me that there is some type of compromise and negotiations going on here concerning your abundance. Because at one point, your feelings were hurt over some type of practicality here. But you could also have some type of blessing coming in. I don't know, someone was like purposely keeping something on hold, purposely keeping your abundance on hold, being deceptive, and now it's being released. I'm going to take a look at the twin flames exposed for you and your partner, Virgo. If you're interested in a private reading, you can reach me at herimmortalmajesty at gmail.com. And it says, sitting here by myself thinking on what to say. Sitting here by myself thinking on what to say. Hmm. I'm going to also take a look at the Hidden Truth Oracle for you and your partner, Virgo. And it says, I don't react when people mention you. I don't react when people mention you. Virgo, this is what happened in the next 48 hours for July the 21st. Through July the 22nd, 2024. You guys give me feedback. Subscribe, like, comment, and share. And follow me on TikTok, Twitter, and Instagram. And I'll see you guys next week. Peace.